In today's video, I'm going to show you how to do the open door transition. So let's get into it. So once you've launched Adobe Premiere Pro and you've created a sequence, we need to drag our footage onto the timeline. So to begin with, we'll just add the footage of the door onto video track two. So there you go, we have this video of me reaching for the door handle and opening the door up. And then we'll just drag some generic footage and throw that onto video layer one. Now from here, selecting the door footage, we want to go into the opacity and we want to select the pen tool and then we want to draw a mask around the open part of the door. Now, as you can see, that has completely removed the door and it has only revealed the part that we want to get rid of. So we go into the mask and we'll just press the inverted box. And then we'll go ahead and generate a brand new keyframe on the mask path. And then we'll just go through the process of updating this mask to follow the door. So as the door opens, the mask should expand and travel with the door. It's really important to note that you should take your time on this. Really make sure you get this perfect because you want this effect to look really clean and really believable. If the mask looks a little bit too harsh, then you can always go and increase the feathering. So if we go into the mask, go down to mask feather, if we just pull up the mask feather, that's just going to blend those edges of that mask out to make this effect look more seamless. Just be super careful that you do not overdo this. And there you go, that is how you do the door opening transition. Now, as you can see in my example, this is super rough because I did rush this just for the purposes of the tutorial. So make sure you spend your time on this and make sure you do a really clear and really clean job of this effect. If you enjoyed watching this video and if you have any requests at all, then please do let me know in the comment section below. And don't forget to subscribe, hit that bell icon, and I will see you tomorrow for another brand new video. See you there.